back to my channel. My name is Ruby Patchouli and on this channel we talk about curls and self-development, self-love. Today I'm kicking off an exciting new series where we dive deep into the beautiful intertwining of hair care and mental health. So in today's video we are going to be exploring the psychological effects of embracing your natural curls. So let's dive in. For years society has placed straight hair on a pedestal. It was always straight hair is beautiful, curly hair, just natural hair in general wasn't as professional, as elegant, as straight hair. That definitely played on a lot of little girls' self-esteem because we never saw representation. Growing up in the magazine, it was always straight hair. For a brief moment in the 90s, curly hair was on the up and up. We were seeing a lot of women, singers, actresses rocking curly hair and that was really dope. But then the 2000s thousands came and everything was straight pinned straight hair. Now this oftentimes made many of us curly girls feel not so great about ourselves. A lot of us felt the need to have to change our natural beauty just so it could fit into societal standards, societal norms. But embracing your curls is a powerful way to challenge those narrow-minded beauty standards and truly accept and love yourself for who you are. Your curls are unique to to you and they are a beautiful way to express your personality. I think about 12, 12 to 17 percent of the entire population has curls. Do you see how unique we actually really are? When people look at our hair, if they're not from America, they, they're usually astonished by what they see because a lot of places this, this is not the norm. And your curls are just a great way to express your own personality, your uniqueness. When you embrace your curls, you are constantly making a statement to the world that, hey, this is who I am and I accept myself the way I am. Am, and I love myself and then you make it possible for someone else to do the same thing for someone else to become inspired by your act of bravery by displaying what God gave you naturally and not hiding from it another psychological benefit is the community the curly hair community and the support that you get from it. You end up meeting so many people who have gone through similar stories just like yourself and who are so willing and open to give advice, to listen to you, and who are trying to embrace their natural curls just like you. By becoming a part of this community, you are automatically presented with tips, with support, with inspiration. It's so amazing. And all you have to do is go on Facebook and type in like curly hair communities and they all pop up and they're so welcoming and you just see photos of so many different type of women with different curl types embracing their curls asking their questions now the last part of this i'm gonna give you a few tips on how to embrace your own curls especially if you are starting out experiment with different products okay because there are so many wonderful products out there but there are also so many bad products. And the only way you're gonna know is if you try it on your hair because everyone's hair is unique to them. We might have the same curl type, but we have different porosity and porosity is usually the most important determining factor if a product is gonna work for you or not. Find a hair care routine that makes you feel good. And what I mean by that is if you don't like a lot of steps and that's very overwhelming for you and it it makes it much harder for you to make it a habit, then that's not the right hair care routine for you. Find something that you can stick to, makes you feel proud that you actually are doing this consistently one to two times a week, continuously do time and time again and you feel good about it. Give yourself some TLC during this routine. Connect with others in your curly hair community and support others. You're gonna need support they're gonna need support. It's all about supporting each other. So that's one of the great benefits of embracing your curly hair or your natural hair. It doesn't have to be curly, it could be kinky too. We welcome kinky, curly, wavies. And last but not least, remember that your curls are a beautiful part of you. There is a reason why God gave you this type of hair texture. It is up to you to learn how to embrace it. And I guarantee you, once you learn how to embrace it, you are going to feel so beautiful and so comfortable in your skin. Embracing your 
your natural texture can be a transformative experience because it not only enhances your self-esteem, but it also allows you to express yourself the way that you were made. I hope this video has inspired you to love your natural hair texture or to start your natural hair journey. So that's all I have for you. That is my first video of my series combining hair care with mental health. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you have a similar experience, if you're already in the curly hair community, please leave a comment, like, subscribe. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and stay tuned for next week's episode. My name is Ruby Patchouli. I post every week a video about curls. See you next week.